Hello everybody! Although many of you already know this product, today we want to show you in detail our bookbinding ruler set and show you how to use it. By using this ruler set, you'll be able to easily bind all your albums. There are two models available, this one in turquoise and another one in pink for those of you who prefer that color. An all shape ruler with 2 cm width that will help you place the cardboard's covers and respect the margins when you'll cover them. A T-shaped ruler, this one will help you to align the covers and the spine, keeping the right distance between them. A separation guide with two positions, one to separate the cardboards by 2 mm and another one to separate them by 1.5 mm. We will choose one or the other position depending on the thickness of the cardboard we are using. Finally, the corner meter tool, one of our favorites. Place it on the corner of the cardboard so that you can cut the right amount of paper to make the perfect angle to cover your cardboard. Now, let's make a simple album structure to show you how to use them. We have the front and back covers and the spine. We are going to use a binding cloth, but you can use any other material. And these are the materials you'll need. The book binding ruler set, a pair of scissors, a scalpel, a ruler, an adhesive, in our case it's going to be the card making glue, a silicone brush to spread the glue and a teflon bone folder. Let's start. Place the L-shaped ruler in the corner to know the right distance at which you will have to place your cardboard. Apply glue to the cardboard. Now, use the Teflon bone folder to press it down so it sticks well. It's time to use the T-ruler. Place the ruler next to the cardboard and now apply glue to the spine and place it next to the ruler. This way, it is aligned with the front cover. Now it's time to glue the back cover, so just repeat the same process. Use the L-shaped ruler to cut the excess of binding cloth. You will be keeping just the right amount of material you need to make the binding. Now it's time to cut the corners with the help of the corner meter tool. It's our favorite part. This will help you cut the excess of material. Apply glue to the larger parts and fold them inwards with the help of a teflon bone folder. Repeat the process with the rest of the sides. Try to apply some pressure in the parts that will become the creases of the album. Before gluing these last sides, fold these little corners with a folder. This way, you'll have a perfect binding. And that's all! The idea behind this set is to make the book bindings easier. You can make all kinds of modifications. Double spine, whatever you like. By using this set, you can make sure that the covers will fold properly and that the corners will be perfect. We hope you find this video helpful. If you have any other questions, please leave them in the comments. See you in the next video.